So, so what I'll do is I'll take this pipe off here, right, and then then I'll connect that one part of the machine and one part of the, and then I, I direct it directly onto uh, onto that rail, and then uh, so you're using my machine, you know, basically. So what I've done there is I've I've, uh, I've put a that's your fuel line from the back, so I've turned the tap off. So that that'll then stop the stop the fuel coming from the from this fuel tank. This one here, I, stick, I, I keep open. Then I attach the fuel to there uh, by fuel, and then that that uh, then I run your car on that fuel. So this is you see this going to there. So this is a this is a fuel for the uh, for the system. The red can is for the uh, for the combustion side, which is the uh, which cleans the injectors, cleans the pistons, cleans the valves. Um, it, it basically removes lacquers and uh, and waxes from the air engine. That's what that, the red can is designed for. And the the black can is designed for to do those put those parts, but it also um, does the exhaust system as well and the your lambda sensors and everything like that so it basically just takes the excess the uh, carbon and dirt off the it doesn't take it all off but it takes off uh, enough to be able to improve the running of the vehicle um, also the machine as well it uh, it, it uh, negatively charges the uh, the molecules so it, it turns to um, it turns to a, a sort of a steam and it just comes out the exhaust as a steam it also puts 11,000 volts through the through the fuel, and it also uh, nano particle changes the actual size of the particles from a, a, sm a large to a small, uh, so it, it takes up a lot more surface area. Um, so basically, you just move the machine over, connect to your 12 volt system on the on the your battery. So this is telling you that you've connected the battery up correctly, and you, you, uh, you're going This is for the red can. This one here is for the black can. So it uses a red can first. Um, so basically, what you do now is you just connect the fuel supply and the and the compressed air to, to here because it, because you've disconnected the fuel filter, the, the fuel pump. From the system, you, you're putting the, the pressure that the fuel pump would normally put in. So you're putting the fuel into the system, into the rail, at the same pressure as the fuel um, pump would have done. So, so you do that by connecting the airline to it. So what you do is you turn turn the pressure up. This is the pressure that's in this pipe, and this is the pressure in the machine. So you turn the, the pressure up to about about 40 psi on this car that's all you need okay and normally you would you would disconnect the uh, the fuel filler flap but because on Peugeot's you're not allowed to take the key out of the filler you have to leave it in so you just have to be sort of conscious of that and that's a that's the system connected up so what I do now is start the car Stabilise your revs. That's basically all you do. And you just watch this uh, this green can lasts about ten, you know, seven to ten minutes, and then it'll go out the black can, and then it then it will it will flash to say that the um, that the system's finished. But you have little cans for up to two litre, and you have bigger cans for up to uh, anything, Rolls Royces, that type of thing. If you think that. You're not, you haven't got enough fuel in there to clean the car properly, then you can put bigger cans on or whatever, you know. So these these are the are the larger cans for over two litre, up to about about four and a half litre, something like that. And then if you put it, if the car's bigger than that, you you put those cans on these cans through as well. So but it's just exactly the same thing as you can see by the can. 
what it's telling you. That the uh, the system's finished, so I let the I let the car run until the, until it it had no fuel left in it. So you've used up all your all the two cans, which took about 20 minutes altogether, maybe it's 25, and then you just let the pressure off. And then there's a, a button on the back here, and that lets the line pressure off. That just allows you to be able to disconnect everything. That's just a bit of pressure in the line because you've disconnected it. You've had it disconnected. But that's that's basically it back on there. Just make sure it hasn't it isn't gonna come off. And that's basically the yeah. Uh, that's a terra clean that's a terra clean service.